everyone. Sorry, I had to look at what time it was. No, afternoon. Good afternoon, everybody. How are you doing today? Welcome to another vlog. Uh, I've got something really special that I'm doing today. I've got about a million things to do for Christmas and um, uh, today's gonna be one of those extra, extra productive kind of day. So I'm really looking forward to it. Um, this time of year is usually our craziest time, especially for me. Um, I do a lot of... Um, oh, who's that? Where was I? So this time of year is very busy for me. I like to do a few things special for um, family and friends and the kids. I'm not sure if you're the same, but um, I've counted in the last couple of years um, how many kids I have to give presents for and it's usually 17, 18 and um, so I've had it stuck in my head that I have about the same this year and I recounted and in the last two years I've gained about eight more babies. <laughs> now I have a million kids to give presents to. I mean it's fun now I'm just gonna have to keep getting more creative when it comes to presents and um, you know things are getting really really expensive for everyone I'm sure you all feel the same um, and uh, yeah, let's see what we can come up with today. Well, at least I'm gonna show you what I decided to do and I think it's really creative and um, not to mention on the cheaper side and it doesn't break back and you know, it's just nicer to look at as well. It's something that I would, have, would be happy to receive um, at Christmas as a child or even now. Um, you know, it will be quite exciting. So I hope um, everyone feels the same way. Also, I'm making something nice for the adults um, as well. Uh, I mean, obviously adults and kids, um, they can share this um, and uh, that's gonna be part of the vlog as well today. So um, yeah, I guess let's get started. You can come along with me and then see how um, fun this day is gonna be. Okay, so are you ready? We are going to make, I am going to make a jar cookie recipe. Ta -da! I've already prepped everything, as you can see, on the tapes. Um, I'm gonna have some M&Ms in it, the sugar, chocolate chips. Um, you see all these types of sugars are going to be in that jar. Um, a few other utensils there, my weighing scale and flour. Um, and all of these are going to be going in those jars there. Okay, let's have some fun! Yay. Okay, first thing we're going to do is the flour mix and that would be the flour, baking powder, baking soda and salt. I'm going to be whisking it all together to make sure that all of the ingredients are incorporated. And that's it! Now we're actually ready to layer the jar. Got our first jar and um, what I'm going to do is to start filling um, start with the flour and then have the sweet M&Ms or chocolate chips and then layer it with the brown sugar and then another layer of white sugar and then top it off with more M&Ms. I'm going to be using a paper plate um, mainly for the flour to help me pour it into the jar to use as a funnel. Clever. <laughs> little bit hmm, slightly bigger for my recipe but it's okay it's okay I mean it's for the kids it looks cute I'll just tell the parents to make sure that they keep it upright so then it doesn't go mixing all over the place so hopefully it stays this way um, you know before the kids open their presents fingers crossed let me know let me know please parents if they stay intact I really hope they do. Okay, there's one thing missing um, from our jar setup. I've realized that I need 
uh, to make sure that there's a recipe card that's included on the tag for the jar. Um, obviously, the kids are going to have to know how to cook it and what to add and stuff. So um, uh, I couldn't. Obviously, I don't have a printer. Who has a printer these days at home? Um, if you want to print something, you're either printing in the office or you're going to the shop or Tesco or wherever just to get you know a print service. And I realised. I have a life print printer so um, and that they print like little small cards like this and it's perfect size to put all of the recipes and well, yeah just for a printout of recipes perfect um, so I've I've been trying it out let me show you okay so here is my little light print printer um, I got this a few years ago and I actually haven't used it since um, using it now because we've started to print, you know, the recipe cards. Um, so I've got it created on my phone and then it just connects via Bluetooth and it prints right there. So then it will look like this. How amazing. And then just wait. There it is, right? Doable, isn't it? That works out really well. I've even got a hole puncher <laughs> for the tags, for the ribbons. I'm having way too much fun with this. By the way, just in case you're wondering, this is by no means sponsored by Life Print. Um, I bought this printer myself a couple of years ago, and um, I finally found like another way of using it. And this is great. This came at perfect timing this year. I mean, 2020. What are you gonna do? What do you think, guys? I had so much fun doing them. I'm quite pleased with those. I hope the kids like them. And I hope they taste good. I mean, I've tr it's tried and tested. I'll show you a clip of um, my testers from yesterday. And um, yeah, they turned out really well. They taste great. Um, I made them. I'm kidding. No, no, I made them. It's my recipe and they actually taste great. They just, it's just a shame that they didn't quite fit the jar. The jar's a bit big, right? But, you know, it's all good. I just hope they don't move around. Fingers crossed. Okay, so now off to doing stuff for the adults. But I won't bother you with that. I'll just show you at the end. Right guys, that is the vlog for today. Thank you for clicking on this video. Um, I hope you enjoyed it uh, and found it helpful and useful and gave you some ideas on maybe what to do for next year. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. We'll see you on the next one. Bye.